Hi, I'm Raymond. I'm the pastor of Westgate Memorial Baptist Church and the author of the Innkeeper's Journal. But uh, probably the most important thing about me is I'm married to Michelle. And Michelle was the one who inspired me to write the story. To tell you the truth, I was just trying to survive Christmas Eve. I had done a, a sermon series called the Innkeeper's Journal. And it was on Christmas Eve, and I wanted to do something a little bit different, so I decided to do this monologue. And I felt really stupid in this outfit and had uh, the brown mascara on my face as a beard. And I couldn't remember the lines. I mean, and finally, I had to take my notes up there at the last minute. And when I got finished, it was just like something really cool had happened. And Michelle came up and said, I want you to do this for our kids at Christmas. I was like, oh, I don't want to do that. I just, I was just a dodged a bullet. But I did. And there was something inside of me that kind of began to think more about this story, and we decided to turn it into a book, and I'm so glad we did. It's a, it's a, a very unusual look at the Christmas story because it goes from the perspective of the innkeeper, not just saying that we don't have any room in the inn, but it talks about the innkeeper's backstory and the fact that uh, he had a child, and his wife was pregnant at the same time that Mary and Joseph arrived in Bethlehem, and ultimately his child dies with all the other children uh, when Herod sends them to Bethlehem. And uh, he becomes a very bitter man along with his wife. In fact, they barely held their marriage together. And about 30 years later, he meets Jesus right before he's crucified. And then he sees him after he's been resurrected. And everything changes in his life. And I think this story could have a major impact on everyone who reads it. It takes only 10 minutes to read it. But it helps us to see the story of Christmas in a different light. And if you'd like to buy the book, you can get it at Amazon.com. And I think one of the neatest things about the story is my friend Matt Chandler did the pictures for it. Beautiful colors that really make the story come alive. And I'd be remiss if I didn't talk about my father-in-law. He did the cover. He's a retired chemist. And he painted this picture about 20 years ago. And it's been in our house ever since. And we put that on the cover. But uh, I really hope you'll take some time to just look at the Innkeeper's Journal and read it with your family this Christmas and hope it becomes a Christmas season, uh, a Christmas classic for every Christmas season. So uh, I'm Raymond, and that's my story. Mm -hmm.